Ryder. Have you seen Lexi? She's not in the med bay? No, and she's not answering her call. I'll find her. They're on an exploration mission. You! You're the Pathfinder! Thank you so much for returning the Moshai to us. I'm glad I could help. Seems your people really cherish her. She is dear to us. By the way, you should know. The head of our delegation is at your cultural center. He'd be honored to speak with you. Should I apply for an outlook? Free for an interview? I'd like to know more about the Angara. It's not often a first contact goes so smoothly. At least the Angara are more peaceful than the Ket. There's high hopes for this alliance. The Angara are survivors, and they're willing to help. They'll be great allies. The Angara soldier who joined your team has a few fans already, but everyone's talking about Aya. Green plants, flowing water? Our leaders have discussed whether we should send colonists there. If the Angara say yes, I don't see why not. I wonder who gets to make that call. The Angara don't have much of a government left. Okay, that's... Colonist registration is up since last episode, as is morale. Tan sent this for you. Inspiring, huh? I don't know, maybe I should have stayed home. You're listening to HNS. And we're happy to help your guards secure their weapons. I prefer them armed, for now. You understand, of course. Oh, Pathfinder, this is the head of the Angaran delegation. The one who saved the Moshai. She speaks highly of you. Call me Issa de Navarre. Welcome, Ambassador. The Angara's first formal visit will be one for the history books. I wonder what they'll say. I was just explaining to the Ambassador that armed guards aren't necessary here. Is something wrong, Ambassador? Please walk with me, Pathfinder. So much life. All different, all united. The way it could have been. Seventy-five years ago, we were scattered, struggling to rebuild after the Scourge. Then, the Ket arrived. Alien life. It was monumental. But then they deceived and enslaved us. So, I hope you understand my precautions. Your people have endured much, Ambassador. I'd be cautious too. Especially when your initiative's first colony is a military outpost. I want to believe in this Alliance, Pathfinder. The Moshai says you're trustworthy. Please, help me trust in you. Everything you see, we're willing to share. Knowledge, technology, support. What's the price? Whatever you're willing to give. They will guard my ship. If you are not conquerors, I trust my person to your honor. Thank you. We won't disappoint you, Ambassador. Pavoa Sekjav Jaravon, Pathfinder. Welcome to Andromeda. Monogender, correct? Yes, the gender binary of other races is irrelevant to us. I've been using Pathfinder, I'm glad you could stop by. Thanks. Of course. In the meantime, have a look around. And when you have a second, check back with me on a favor I'd like to ask. Pathfinder, do you have a moment? We, uh, need to explain you. Explain me? Our new VI over there is meant to describe the role of our Pathfinders, but it just lost all its settings in a crash. If you could fix them, that would really help us out. Just talk to the VI, and it'll do the rest. Thanks. 
Of course. I'm meeting with Director Allison. Exploration and discovery. Very well said. Next, should I emphasize the role of the Pathfinder team or their partner AI? Go with the Pathfinder's team. Very well said. Finally, should I provide career advice to future Pathfinders or an honor of former Pathfinders? List the former Pathfinders. Setup complete. Would you like to keep these settings? It all sounds good to me. to the cultural center. Mm, there's so much to study here. <laughs> ah, it would take a lifetime. There's thousands of years of history before humans even arrive on the scene. That would be a nice full-time job. But you've already got one. Interesting place, isn't it? Full of smiles and handshakes. Not many soldiers. Even though when politicians make peace, it's we soldiers who keep it. Politicians get nervous when you hold anything more explosive than a rotten egg. <laughs> You've seen this too. The military life echoes everywhere. But names. I know you, Pathfinder. I am Andrachno, a Heskal with the Resistance. A Heskal? Centuries ago, Heskal were special forces. We defended colonies, passing our training down via oral history. Few remember us today. I came to learn what the Milky Way knows of such things. I heard your father was part of a similar program, an N7. He was one of the first N7s. He was proud of that, even though he didn't stay in service. Didn't stop him teaching me and my sister a few tricks. So, you carry a little of that knowledge with you, as well as your Pathfinder skills. N7 training would benefit my people. Heskal training would benefit yours. Perhaps a few war games. Show me how your skills handle the tests of a Heskal recruit. Challenge yourself and teach me. A chance to work with the Angaran best of the best? Absolutely. Excellent. I'll activate our training beacons. Finding them can be your first test. After that, I look forward to learning.
Pathfinder, those bioscans are superb. Could you gather more for our comparative conservation effort? What conservation effort? Ah, my thesis is on the console there. Broad strokes, we're comparing and preserving organisms from both galaxies. If you donate more bioscans and samples to the catalog, I can get you a finder's fee. Tempted? Pathfinder, we've had some trouble. Anything I can help with? Perhaps. I discharged an away team to get readings from a section of the Scourge that was behaving anomalously. They haven't reported in for some time, and sensors can't locate their shuttle. I sent them out there. Good, dedicated people. I fear what might have happened to them. Don't give up hope. When I'm out there, I'll see if I can find them. Their friends and family will want to know what's happened, and I... I need to know. My model of Helios blossoms with data, thanks to you. Here, please. You have earned this. Hi, Pathfinder. Want to hit some rocks for science? Absolutely. What do you need? Sam and I used your scans and made a VI for geophysics surveys. Beta builds on the console there. Test it out in the field, and I'll wrangle you a consultant's bonus from Director Addison. How's that sound? The beauty of the cosmos unfolds in your planet scans, Pathfinder. But there is more they can do. Do you have something in mind, Doctor? Plans for a school are underway to inspire a new generation of young minds. I want to craft a model of the cluster for them, accurate and splendid from your data. My prototype is on that console. Add more scans to improve it, and I will share my educational budget with you. And my thanks. Every step we've taken in Andromeda Unlocking. has been dangerous. Come on in. The initiative needs to defend itself. Ta-da! My project. She is complete. She? Looks like a she to me. Just a proof of concept. I stripped out its remnant command prompts to see if I could power it up myself. It worked! Now I can build a field model with combat protocols that fights for you. So, uh, what do you think? Have Suvi and Gil look it over. If it checks out, bring it aboard and fast-track the combat model. Okay. I guess I understand your skepticism. Oh no, I forgot to lock the... Shit. My, my, Pelisaria. Didn't know you were still using this hole. Who's your friend? Kalinda, this is Ryder. Oh, everyone knows the human Pathfinder. I meant, who's your remnant friend? None of your business, Kalinda. 
Of course it isn't. That's what makes it so interesting. Don't be so hostile, babe. No reason we can't all be civil, right? Exactly. But you are kind of trespassing, so... Now, now. I was just concerned something might have happened to my dear old friend. I'm sorry for the intrusion, Pelisaria. I'm just relieved to see you moving on. Ta-ta. I'll walk you out. So, want to talk about it? Well, Kalinda and I go way back. We joined the initiative together. For a long time, we were like family. Now we're not. When you live a thousand years, Ryder, people come and people go. Entanglements are silly. Just like places. Time to pack this one up. I'm done with it. But how can you give all this up? Ha! <laughs> Watch me. Easy come, easy go. I'll pack up my new pet and essentials. See you back on the Tempest. Just when I've balanced the air mix, another Yahoo has to come wandering through. Aren't you the Pathfinder? Dr. Camden, head of hydroponic sciences. Mind the seedlings. Are you always this rude to people walking in? Only when a mistake could kill everyone on the Nexus. What do you mean? <sighs> hydroponics is our air, food and water. A frail green line between us and oblivion. We almost lost it all during the mutiny. Now it's my responsibility. I know what surprise responsibility can be like. So I hear. Perhaps we could share our burdens. I need samples of Andromeda's plant life. Our own specimens should acclimatize to them. Bring me any plants you find. You'll have a bounty in return and my thanks. A violent illness related to the flag of Teavuni. Let's hear it. What? Oh, another one. Damn it. This is supposed to be the chemistry lab. My chemistry lab. You all keep crawling out of the woodwork like space cockroaches. You say that, Dutch, but here you are, pouring people drinks. Uh, hi. I'm standing right here. They're guinea pigs, damn it. Chemists should have guinea pigs. Not have their labs taken over by people giving them things and... and being nice. Aren't bartenders usually friendly? You're kind of hostile. I'm not supposed to be a bartender. I'm supposed to be a chemist. Don't let Dutch put you off. He's a sweetie, really. I'm not. And the drinks are good. Damn right they are. Uh, I mean... <sighs> yeah. I'm a dirty squirrel. Welcome to the Vortex. There you are.
looking for the meaning of life? At the bottom of a bottle? You wouldn't be the first to try. Alcohol rarely provides answers. Then why are you here? What? I can't kick back? Have fun? Man, no offense. It's just... Just what? You don't seem like you're having fun. <sighs> I grew up on Omega. You'd think I'd know how to drink. What's this really about? PB thinks I don't care about the crew. That you're all just experiments to me. Do you... Is that how you think I see you? You can be... distant. Then I'll be clear. I care about you as a person. Same goes for the rest of the crew. Even PB? Yes, even the stowaway. <sighs> I should get back. What about your wine? I'll save it for another day. Still missing some parts. Anything? Damn it. Ryder. You're not on the bridge, Captain? We powered it down. Can't afford to waste energy. Though Cryo Bay and Sam Note are exempt. 
And I told them to keep their hands off Alex's quarters. You have access now. Thanks. Hey, sorry about your father. He was really good at what he did. Just not so good at working with people. He was right about going planetside, though. I wish you were still here. There's so much you could have taught me. You'll do fine. You're off to a good start. If there's anything else I can help with, let me know. Thanks for the talk. All right. I have requests to submit, administrators to harass, and people to wake up. I'd better get to it. Good luck out there. Writer, one of your father's memories is available. Let's see it. This memory is of a family gathering on Earth. Finally, the Ryder clan in one room. It feels like it's been years since we were together. Or more. Well, I'll take whatever I can get. I've missed you two. How are you feeling, Mom? No, we're not doing that. There's only one rule for this visit. No talking about me. I'm fine. And when I'm not, the pills help. Deal? Okay. Good. Let's talk about something else. Alec? Um... Really? Well, uh... You're both looking... taller. Yeah, Dad, that does tend to happen. Right, right, I know. So, um... I heard the Alliance has a new Mako in the works. Yeah, word is they can airdrop this one from a ship. I know. They're saying we might get one on our next expedition. You still poking around the attic in Traverse? It's amazing. We think we might have found a Prothean site. No artifacts yet, but we're still digging. Ah, oh, I remember the day they found the first ruins on Mars. Changed my life. We knew for sure that aliens were real. We just had to go find them. Yes, every day I wake up, I'm looking at a Mass Effect relay, and I keep thinking, what's on the other side? Don't lose that. The minute you stop wondering what's beyond the mountain, you die a little inside. No chance of that. It's in our blood. You infected us. What was it like, Dad? When you went through that first relay? <laughs> Don't believe the stories. The Garon relay scared the shit out of us. Admiral Grissom included. Why don't we go have this dinner your mom's been slaving over all day? I'll tell you all about it. I remember that. Mom complained the Ryder clan was never in the same room at the same time. Odd, considering you were family. That's all you need to know. Dad wasn't much fun to hang around with. The awkward silences could last for hours. Yet you shared a common interest. Yeah, good or bad, your parents rub off on you. A form of symbiosis? Sure, I suppose. Though not always beneficial. It gave rise to you. Jury's still out on that. Nevertheless, the emotional bonds among family became clear to me that day. Your progress as Pathfinder has unlocked an additional memory. Let's see it. This memory is when Alec first learned the initiative. It will be just a moment. Hello, Alec. I'm too old for cloak and dagger. I got your message. I'm here. Who are you? A benefactor, if you like. You have something to offer me? A future. That's vague. A future? For your wife. You're out of money. Your contacts have dried up. You can't finish Sam. How do you know about... I can help you. Whatever you need. Start by telling me what you need. Your AI is more than a cure for your wife. It could also be the salvation for many others. I don't follow. Where we're going, we'll need a different perspective to understand things. Where's that? The Andromeda Galaxy? I have a proposal for you. And Ellen doesn't have much time. Are you interested?
Who was that? The benefactor? I believe there was more to the Andromeda Initiative than was publicly understood. Private logs are now available in your father's quarters. They may shed further light on the matter. I detect additional memories, but they are currently locked. They may yet hold answers. Okay, I'll keep working on it. That's all for now. Of course. Your father's personal logs. I had a strange meeting yesterday. I thought it would be with Jien Garson who founded the initiative, but it wasn't. I guess Jien's the visionary, the one who gets everyone excited about the project and drums up publicity. But then this benefactor apparently provides resources and money. And I mean a lot of money. It's a little unusual. But everything about this project is. Interesting. I wonder if Director Tan knows anything about this. Worth talking to him. I accepted the initiative's offer. They're calling me a Pathfinder. <laughs> There's no other option left. Sam will never happen without their help. Our savings are gone, and no one will return my calls. I am a pariah. There's something strange going on with this benefactor. But... Ellen's getting worse. I can't fail her. Davis Carr, Helios News Service. Maybe you've heard my voice over the vids. I'm trying to file a story right now, but hey. H&S, huh? Where are the rest of you? I had an editor, but it's crazy out here. Now, beyond a freelancer or two, I'm it. All that stands between freedom and tyranny, or something. I haven't had much sleep. Talk to you later, Davis. Hey, Ryder. Before you go, I hate to ask, but it seems like your job takes you all over, to places we can't broadcast yet. If I send receivers to your ship, would you mind placing them on some planets? It'll help get news out to even the most far-flung colonists. Okay, Davis. I'll help you get set up. Great. Just place a receiver near an outpost, and they'll get our reports. It's you! You're the human Pathfinder! I'm Sid, Vetra's sister. Vetra's told me all about you. Well, not all about you, but the important bits. I should probably get back to work. It was real nice meeting you, though. I'll let you get back to work. Tracking enemy no, activity. You. Zones 2, 12, 19. I can't. A new species? What if I... 
you know, offend them. Screw up everything our diplomats have done. You're showing them guns, Syax, not how to use a salad fork. Hey, Ryder, I'd like a moment. Yes? Lieutenant Syax, right? That's me. I'm putting together Apex strike teams to protect the people and assets you're setting up out there. We don't have a good sense of what we're up against, and could benefit from your experience. I'll have Sam upload our insights on the Cat, Remnant, and Outlaw forces we've encountered. Thanks. You'll see. Apex will make a difference. The Cultural Center requests special dietary instructions for Angaran visitors. Construction and repairs continue. Pathfinder? May I have a word? What is it? You're out there, facing the cat. We hear only rumors making them out to be monsters. Maybe they just don't understand us. Do you think peace could ever be possible? The cat seems set in their ways. So it would be up to us to change? If they have their way, they'll change us into them. That's what they do. Oh, I see. We must continue the fight then. Thank you for your time. Afternoon, Pathfinder, or morning. I can keep time according to any of the worlds we've detected. Director Addison finds it annoying. <laughs> I have a specific person I want brought out of Cryo. Name and designation if available. I heard that the chief engineer on EOS went back into Cryo. There have been a few such requests. The first few months in Helios were disheartening. Now that Prodromos is on track, I want her redeployed. Chief Engineer Grace Leto, designation E-97 Durango. Deployment will begin shortly. Is there anything else, Pathfinder? Another time. Pathfinder. Way. Congratulations are in order. Peaceful contact with the Angara. It's everything the initiative stands for. It was amazing. A culture we'd never met before, in a brand new galaxy. I was just glad to be part of it. It's a moment to savor. In the Milky Way, first contact was a rare event. I hope rescuing the Moshe leads to stronger ties between our people. Did you have some other business? I'm curious. What do you know about the people who backed the initiative? What everyone knows. Gian Carson was the founder and visionary. Unfortunately, she died on the Nexus during the Scourge disaster. Is there anyone else? I would almost welcome them. A voice to silence the rabble. Then Cash might listen. But no, we're alone. Why do you ask? <laughs> no reason. Guess I was hoping the cavalry was on the way. Yes. If only she'd left. No, Gian Carson was the beacon. A sad end to someone of such stature. Dying alone. Oh? It was chaos. By the time they found her, she was already dead. Succumbed to her injuries. Was there a follow-up investigation? I wasn't even out of stasis. But knowing the violence of the Scourge disaster, death was everywhere. If you're suggesting something else happened, Ryder, I'd rather you didn't. Let's not add to the confusion. Thank you for your time.
Ryder, if you wish to pursue this further, accessing Nexus security records may reveal more information. fact is that her body was found in one of the apartments. Then connecting her death to the Scourge disaster was mere speculation. Yeah, they just wanted this to go away. I think we need to check out that apartment. Environmental data will allow us to reconstruct the scene. This is where Jean Garson's body was discovered. What are we looking for? If you scan the room, environmental data may allow for scene recreation. There. This was no accident. She was murdered. As this incident occurred over a year ago, her killer is likely far away by now. Yeah. But... Wait. This whole area was shuttered back then. Didn't open until the Hyperion arrived. So what was Garson even doing here? Perhaps a further scan of the room is in order. A hidden door. What do we have here? This is Gian Garson. I don't have much time. I've been hiding in the sealed off sections of the Nexus since we got here. Someone's trying to kill me, and now I can hear them down in the hydroponics area. They're coming. I've embedded what I know in my VI in the cultural center. This log has the code, and whatever happens... Oh god, they're outside the door! Wow, this is some serious shit. Yes, deeply troubling. I have the code she mentioned for the VI kiosk. hear that message Garson talked about? Unlocking it now. Rerouting to our private channel. For years, there was a silent partner involved with the initiative. The truth is, I was running out of money. Then a benefactor stepped in. I didn't ask questions. I never met them face to face. That was a mistake. I lied to everyone. Something big spooked them in the Milky Way, and now they're moving a hundred thousand of us to Andromeda. I hope it's all for the good, but I have my doubts. And now I think they're going to remove me. Alec Ryder and I had a code word for this. Fulcrum. He may have learned more. What did that mean? Something big in the Milky Way? Perhaps your father's locked memories hold the answer. He might have known more. Yeah. Guess I'll have to keep unlocking them to find out for sure.
know about these Angara. Whoa! It's the Pathfinder! It's me. You're the one who befriended these strange new people, these Angara. And now they're... here. On the Nexus. How do we know we can trust them? I mean... for certain. Remember, we're the strangers. This is their home, and they've welcomed us. They've earned our trust. I guess. Talk to them. Get to know them. See for yourself. Good advice. I will. We invite you to visit our merchants in the Nexus Commons area. We've had no trouble, Pathfinder. 